It has been one year since Hololife English Avon first graced our screens with their presence and have proven to be one of the most iconic generations of virtual idols who have blessed the VTuber community in recent memory. The dynamic and chemistry the rebellious five jailbirds of the third English generation share is nothing short of remarkable and unbreakable. All five members have something for everyone, and it got them to where they are today. This past month, they were able to have their own 3D showcases. A symbol of recognition and more than just a special performance. They represent what fan support can do for them, which they rightfully deserve. Join me as we look back at the legacy of Hollow Advent and what they have accomplished this past year. Hi, my name is Yui Tajibana, and I would like to say Hollow Life Advent has been so special to me in the past year they have been here. So to understand just how special they are, we do have to go back to July 2023. At this point, we had gone almost two years waiting for a third English generation. The 11 girls we had in the meantime, they were just so perfect and still are to this day. The amount of passion that was put into these groups were so overwhelming and exceptional that the newcomers honestly had a lot on their shoulders. There was a lot to live up to. But as it is with the way of Hololive, they always find a way to make these groups so special that they're beyond irreplaceable. They are idols who live up to their hype, potential, and character development as shown with the interactions they share with both their gem mates and fan bases. Their debut trailer made them look so rebellious and just people you just didn't want to mess with. But as always, over time they became some of the most funniest comedians the VTuber community has seen yet. Shiori Novella as a whole speaks for herself. When she first debuted, she became known for not keeping her fridge clean, which is a given since she's the type to look at bugs for a hobby. The goth girl won people's hearts over regardless, whether it would be her soft adorable voice, her love for books and writing, or the countless amount of sus things she has said in the past year alone. She is much more than a Manhara though. While it can be easy to consider her a lost cause, we mostly say that as a joke. In reality, the girl is different, and that's amazing. If we all acted the same, the world would be unbearable. Shiori has become known for having quite the imagination and letting it be known she is the ideal girlfriend. Someone who can be weird, but also fun to be around. She is also known for her piano playing and recommending a lot of books to us. As I am someone who just hates reading, let me tell you, if this girl is my librarian, count me in. She'll make me do anything, I swear. Koseki Biju, or Bibu as she's been more well known as, has proven to be quite the handful herself. She is someone who has quite literally become the gen alpha kid of Hololive, but we all still love Bibu anyway. If anything, she is just impossible to dislike. Her energy and happy face that she makes is just so diabetes that it's unbelievable. She is someone who I see as a daughter figure, being a girl who is precious and I would just want to snuggle for hours on end. Bibu was also the first girl who caught my eyes on the trailer if I'm being honest. I predicted that Bibu would be my Oshi in Hollow Advent. While my Oshi ended up being Shiori, Bibu is one hell of a good contender. And if she's your Oshi, let me know in the comments below. I absolutely adore Bibu's energy and love that she has nothing but fun. Nerissa Ravencroft is another amazing addition to Hololife, from her debut cover alone with how crazy her vocal range was. The girl was destined for success from the start. I was already waiting to see this woman put out EPs and albums, and sure enough, we finally got her debut EP this month, but I'm getting ahead of myself. Nerissa has proven to be quite the singing idol who doesn't even need to try to prove herself at this point. If you look at her covers and her karaoke, you'll know what I mean. She has potential to be the English Suisse with how committed she is to being a music idol. Nerissa is also known for being, well, how should I say, suggestive. Just like her gem mate Shiori, Nerissa has become known for her adult talk and flirting with Shiori every chance she gets. Well, now she got her eyes on Liz, but my point still stands. This girl really trying to start a harem out here, and I'm all for it. She's collecting waifus like she's Issei Hiyoro. She's also the one Avent member to have a more mature voice and is also the tallest Hololive member too, which really makes her stand out. And in my mind, I'm thinking, MOMMY, I WANT YOU ON TOP! <clears throat> Please excuse my degeneracy. Anyway, Fuamoko, they need no introduction. You know how they are, and so do I. The twin dogs stood out as the first official duo in Hololive, sharing one channel as they benefit off each other's charisma and sisterhood, which really makes them all the more the merrier by definition. The girls have become known for their semi-daily talk show Fuamoko Mornings, which has been quite the blast to watch. We're also not going to forget the Kendrick Lamar Silent Hill cover they did, one of the most unexpected karaoke songs in Hollow Life history. But that's what makes them special. Fuamoko together are unique and too irresistible, and have rightfully earned their spot as VTuber legends. They're inseparable beings who radiate the very concept of being idols, girls who are role models for people, and are just outright irreplaceable overall. Bow bow. 
Together, Hololive Evan has shown a lot of potential over the past year, and they have exceeded my expectations in a lot of ways. For one, the 3D showcases that we just got. For the first two generations, it would have taken longer for them to receive them, but because they made Hololive English what it is today, they are now able to afford to do the 3D showcases much earlier for Evan, and maybe for Hollow Justice too. Every girl's 3D showcase was cute and entertaining. I honestly couldn't tell you which one was my favorite. I'm gonna say all of them, cause like I said, everyone in this group is perfect, and and we shouldn't take them for granted. What they have accomplished in a year is a great feat. In addition, they will also be part of the Hololife English second concert in New York, which I sadly wasn't able to get tickets to, but they are going to participate in it, and I'm just so, so proud of them. Take this video as an appreciation letter because they very much deserve it, and I'm looking forward to what they're going to bring in 2025 and beyond. Wish them good luck on their futures, and we shall see what surprises they bring going forward. Who is your Ocean Hollow Avid and what makes that girl stand out to you and what's your favorite moment from Hollow Live Avid? Let me know in the comments below and thanks for watching this video. Please support the Patreon and my Kofi and follow me on X slash Twitter and subscribe to my channel. I upload weekly. Special thanks to Jason N for supporting the Patreon. If you'd like to get a shout out at the end of my videos, please help support the Patreon. This is your sunshine, Yui Tachibana, signing out.